I would be a doctor probably. I actually went to medical school for about two months. I know more about the citric acid cycle than really anyone needs to, in including most physicians, and uh, dissected a human backside. I like to do antiquing. I have a 200-year-old home, and uh, which is my biggest antique. I, I enjoy doing that. I draw, I paint. I always thought I'd be the coroner, you know, do autopsy, <laughs> stuff like that. <laughs> coroner? I didn't yes. know you ever wanted to be a coroner. I've known you how long? You know I'm a ghoul. I love all that sort of thing. That is true. She loves those ghoulish things. If I was not an author, I think I would go to medical school and learn how to be an ER technician. I think it's just fascinating, the idea of trying to save a life every day. I would work in a zoo. Oh, that's great. I would love to work in a zoo. It's an animal lover. Yes. Mm -hmm. With the ones that don't eat people. I would probably still be training horses. I, horses have been a real um, focal point for me. They're very important and they, they keep me sane. So I own a construction company and that's another business of mine. My family's been in it for years. I've done all kinds. I've done everything from being a janitor, I've put in stuff at tanks. Not a good job. <laughs> it's a crappy business. I would be writing in some capacity. I've written in some capacity all my life. I've had corporate jobs and creative jobs and I played for years in a band, but every aspect, every single one of those jobs to some extent required expressing myself in writing. Mm -hmm.